If you're thinking about buying a house and you've seen what prices are selling for, then you probably wish you would have bought one years ago, say in 2016, where at least here in Rochester, Minnesota, you could have purchased a four bedroom, two bathroom home for about $180,000. Now, fast forward to today in 2021, that same home is probably going to cost you right around $250,000. If you're looking to buy, this probably sounds pretty depressing, but my goal with this video is to give you some perspective and information information so that you can make the best decision as whether you should buy now in 2021 or whether you should wait to buy in 2022 or in the future. The first thing that we should look at is what has happened within the last year. Within the last year, homes have appreciated about 18% nationally. Here in Rochester, Minnesota, homes have appreciated about 12% with a medium home price of $250,000. If we look at new construction in Rochester, it has actually gone up at 17% six percent with a medium uh, sale price of about four hundred and fourteen thousand dollars this is not surprising because the cost of lumber and other construction materials have gone up significantly within the last year now the other thing to point out about uh, home price appreciation is that it has gone up different price points within different regions and within different metros here in the United States if we take a look at this bar graph we can see that price appreciation has gone up within in the different uh, price points whether it's a low price point or a high price point if we take a look at previously owned homes here in rochester minnesota that are over 2500 square feet we can see that they have appreciated at about 21 percent with a median home price of three hundred and ninety six thousand dollars now if we take a look at previously owned homes that are 1500 or less square feet we can see that they have appreciated at about 15 percent and with a median sale price of $202,000. This shows that bigger homes have appreciated more than smaller homes. Now if we look at this map, we can see that across every region in the US, homes have appreciated about 14.9%. And if we take a look at this chart, we can see the increases have happened across each of the top 20 metros in the country. In Minneapolis, which is the closest metro to Rochester, we can see that the appreciation has been at 13.8%. And if we take a look at Phoenix, they've had a 29.3% increase, San Diego a 27.1% increase, and Seattle a 25%. Now it's nice to see that even though prices have appreciated significantly here in Rochester, Minnesota, we're still pretty affordable and a lot lower than in other cities and metros. The big question is, what's going to happen in 2022? Well, if we look at the Home Price Expectation Survey, which is a survey of over 100 economists, investment strategists, and housing market analysts, they're predicting to see a 5.12% appreciation in 2022. If we look at four other major entities and what they're expecting, the National Association of Realtors is expecting a 4.4% appreciation, the Mortgage Bankers Association is expecting an 8.4% appreciation, and Fannie Mae a 5.1%, and Freddie Mac a 5.3%. Let's assume just a 5% appreciation for 2022. If you were to buy now, let's say a home for $300,000, right? If you buy it now, that's what you would pay for it. And if you wait until 2022, according to this estimate for appreciation, you would be buying it at $315,000. So if you're looking to buy based on the information of what experts are saying and what has happened within the last year, you're probably better off buying in 2021 because you're going to buy at a lower price than in 2022. The appreciation won't be as high as it was last year, but you're still going to buy at a higher price. Now, if you're looking to sell, right, this is a good time because you're not going to get that much appreciation in 2022. And if you're looking to buy a house, then you're going to get the house at a lower price now than if you wait until 2022. I hope that you found this video helpful, that it gave you some perspective. And if you're interested and want to stay up to date with real estate market, at least here in Rochester, Minnesota, send me a message because I send every month a monthly market update update so that you can stay up to date. Feel free to give me a call, text or message me if you have any questions and thank you so much for watching.